Hi guys, it's Rue here. I said I'd take advantage of the nice day and come out and do a vlog. It's been a little while, gone a bit too long again, so um, I'm cheating today. Um, we're in Truth Helmet because it's easier. Um, and he, he had a very suspicious grin on his face when I was leaving because I was wearing his helmet. And I said, does it look stupid on me? And you know, it's, you know what his helmet is like. And I'm on a scooter and he drives a big bike. And I like, do I look stupid? And he said, no, you don't. <laughs> so that's okay. Um, it's just easier. I'm only out for the spin just to do the vlog. I'm not going anywhere in particular. So, and he's not using his helmet right now. So it makes good sense. And it's nice and dry today for a vlog as well, so we, no reason not to do it. It's a Sunday afternoon and I'm not doing anything, so no excuses there. And I'm wearing his um, dark, darker visor. Um, it's lovely. Oh, I didn't realise how nice it is to have a dark visor on. Um, I don't know what's... Tinted visor, that's it. So it's nice, yeah, I really like that. It's easy on the eyes. Um, if it's not raining, it's getting bugs in my face. So I, ooh. So I do need to have um, the visor down anyway, that's for sure. I got a fly in my eye on the way to work the other day. And the day after that, I got soaked. So can't win at this minute with this weather. Um, yeah, I was watching, um, I was watching the garden snakes <laughs> video uh, about the three top things in life. <laughs> He's funny. He is actually very, very funny. Do you know that? I like his vlogs, but this one was very good. And um, he was saying like f sex, food, and taking a big dump were the three best things. But And I agree, I'm certainly not disagreeing with that. But um, I was thinking that there's another one and I, I just thought, what about the funny moments in life, the things that make you laugh, really, really laugh? You know, I think they're top in life as well. But I know it's not, it was, it was just the top three, but I'm just adding this one in. I just think funny things should be in there because it's laughter, really. It's having fun and laughing that makes life, I think. And on that note, uh, speaking of that, I have a very funny story to tell you. Um, one of my first jobs was in an office, and uh, a secretary, you know, a uh, receptionist and secretary and all that stuff in an accountant's office in a town near where I used to live. And myself and a girl that lived down the road worked there, so we didn't have lifts. I mean, this was crap money. I was on 55, 55 pounds, uh, 95 a week <laughs> back then. This is back going back a good few years ago now. Uh, it was my first one, as I said. And um, we didn't have cars or anything, so we're always getting lifts off people. And it was no problem. There's always someone going in. We had a few different lifts arranged on different days and things. And. Um, this um, particular day, anyhow, we used to thumb a lot as well. And this particular day, uh, I was on the, we were on the way home and we were thumbing a lift, the two of us. So it was my turn to do the thumbing bit anyhow. Plus, um, this girl usually left a thumbing to me anyway. She was quite reserved, but she, mostly I did the thumbing. But I did the thumbing this particular, <laughs> this particular day. Mm. Uh, saw a car coming. Sometimes if I recognised the car, because we always knew the cars on the road, you know. Um, back then, it's just back in, you know, in, in a small town in Ireland, everyone kind of knew everyone. Well, we knew we'd be careful about getting lifts, but it wasn't like this big dangerous thing, you know. That's, you, I wouldn't have a lift now for anything. And that's the truth. I wouldn't dare thumb a lift off anybody. And I definitely wouldn't do it in the UK because I don't know anyone over here. But back then it was okay. And anyway, get to the point. Get to the point, Ruth. Um, I was thumbing this lift. And sometimes, you know, if I knew the person, as I said, I'd mess and I'd stick my leg out. Because, you know, 
office wear, little short black skirt, high heels, you know, the little white blouse, you know the drill. It was a summer's evening. Sometimes I stick my knee out messing like, like, a, well, kind of like a hooker, just for fun, just for fun. Because I know the person, they'd laugh, they'd pull in, they'd give us a lift, job done. But this particular day, I didn't know the car that was coming, this dark car was coming along anyhow, and I said to my friend, her name was Mary, I said, Mary, Mary, it's a lift coming, get ready. And um, I did the thumbing anyhow, I just did a suit, put out my thumb, like, and the car was coming along anyway, and it's getting nearer and nearer, and it was going quite slow, and I was looking, and I started to realise, actually, there's a queue of cars here. Um, what's going on? And the car is getting nearer, and my thumb is out, and I'm still thumbing. And the next thing, I looked at Mary, and we looked at each other, she said, stop, stop, stop! And I pulled in, <laughs> I took my thumb away straight away, and just, we jumped into the ditch out of embarrassment, because it was actually a funeral. <laughs> I thumbed the funeral, guys. I don't know if I was seen. If I was, I was probably recognised. And it wasn't the very most respectful thing you can do in Ireland, especially, is thumb a funeral and a short mini skirt on. But there you have it. I, it's, it's something I did. Um, yeah, I'm putting that out there. Um, yeah. Yeah. Let's never speak of this again, okay? I'm telling you this, guys. I'm, I'm just telling you this, you know, in secret. Um, I'm not making it, I don't want to make this public knowledge or, <laughs> or anything. No, seriously, that's the story, guys. Um, just thought I'd give you a bit of a giggle there. Uh, true story, Barney Farm, uh, How I Met Your Mother. True story, guys. It was legend, wait for it, legendary. <laughs> Take it easy, guys, and ride safe. Bye.